this is Luke Darnall back with another video. Um, I'm just going to keep this quick. I'm just showing or relaying my thoughts on this week's drop list uh, for March 10th, 2022. It's the collaboration with Marbury. Um, I don't really give a shit for Mar Marbury or Burberry, whatever the hell it is. Um, I'm just here to make some quick cash so I can buy some shit that I actually want. Uh, I ended up getting this, what is it, maroon or forget what color they call this. This is the only sweatshirt Supreme I have with a hood. I have a crew um, without the hood or whatever, uh, which I love too in black, but hoodies are just so damn expensive. But let me just go ahead. Uh, well, first of all, just real quick, I got this in the mail earlier and made me chuckle. But all right, I ordered a shirt to support my man, Andrew Hales, um, a YouTuber. He sent me this. That's his, uh, his loft. Well, he sent me this little three pack of stickers. This is a YouTube channel, um, which is one of the stickers here. I ordered a t-shirt. I'm just throwing the, the dude a bone and he sent me these stickers save the best for last year goat or the original loft goat bitch ass goat you know i guess i am a bitch ass goat too but look at him that's andrew right there <laughs> so uh he sent me these stickers i guess he's hurting for some cash um he even wrote i love you so, I mean, very personable. If this is even him, I think it would be. But I appreciate the sticker pack. I'm gonna have to double check now, but I thought it was ordered a tea um, with Andrew's face on it. So, um, but yeah, shout out to Andrew. Thank you a lot. Um, that was funny, it kind of made my day. It was just hilarious that you did. And he wrote a little piece of paper. He just ripped a piece of paper off and said, thank you for the support. Because we're all bitch ass goats, I guess, to, to Andrew. With my shout out out of the way, let's go ahead and bam! Get myself in the corner and uh, let's get into what I recommend. All right, so we're out the gate, 11 a.m. EST. Um, I will be copying, we're going for the pink or the light pink hoodie, Supreme. It's BOGO, it's another BOGO. Uh, boxed logo supreme week uh, so they are highly sought after consistently whenever they rarely drop these and they're dropping them so um the black and the gray they go you can wear those year round, year round um so the point i'm making is there's more demand for those two sweatshirts they will fly the pink won't fly as fast, but it will still fly being a box logo, Supreme Collaboration Burberry uh, box logo um, on merch. So I will be going for size medium. I would recommend size medium or size large. I go for mediums because that's my size when it pertains to Supreme stuff usually. Um, it's just a good habit for me because every millisecond is a precious millisecond. So. I will be going for that pink hoodie. Um, in my opinion, I think the gray hoodie, hands down, is the best item of this drop list. So that will fly the quickest, undoubtedly. Um, secondly, will be this t-shirt, the white t-shirt with the Supreme box logo. Now, um, this is a spring summer, so, and the white background to this um, plaid Burberry mixed, you know, collaboration box logo Supreme just goes a lot better than this black. <clears throat> the black t-shirt, because it's a t-shirt compared to a sweatshirt, it's just not a, the seasonal piece right now. Um, we'll go just as fast, um, but I think it will be just behind this black hoodie. Hoodies are just like, in my book, the, the pinnacle of Supreme, just Supreme, Supreme Boss logo hoodies. So, um, but these, because there's simply two t-shirts, these will fly ridiculously fast too. 
Um, so I think the gray sweatshirt will fly first because it looks so good. It really does. Um, then the white tee, then the black sweatshirt, then the black tee. And then finally, fifth and final, finally will be that pink sweatshirt. Um, I use a practical sense when I go about these things and trying to flip, flip for a quick uh, profit. Uh, the pink, generally, you don't see people wearing pink. Um, it really hasn't caught on to a lot, especially guys. I mean, so it just simply doesn't pertain to as many, so the demand is going to be lower, but there is still a lot of margin of profit for this item. So I will, no doubt, as 11 a.m. EST hits Thursday, um, the 10th of March, which is tomorrow, um, I will be swooping swiftly, promptly, all the above. I will be acting accordingly. I hope keeping my emotions at bay, but I will be trying to cop that pink hooded box logo sweatshirt in pink in a size medium. Um, hopefully I get back or, or get to that processing sc screen, punch in my CVV number for my credit card, get the payment, for, boom. Hopefully we get through quickly. Immediately after that, I will have a second tab open um, and I will be going for this black rugby shirt. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Um, I'll be going for the black. It's so simple. You can, use, you can wear this year round. It pertains to both male, female, everything in between. Um, and it is very British. Like Burberry is like London, England kind of stuff. So I just think there's going to be, I mean, this is hands down the best in this line. I'm, I'm almost certain it'll be out by by then after I after the seconds lost by that point, but we will see. It's worth a shot. But those two items alone, that's all I'm going for this week. I'm trying to make money, generate some income here through flipping and copying merchandise or shoes at times, um, so I can then fund my own creativity and pretty much fund uh, my own fashion, or at least help uh, the blow of these ridiculous prices at times. So, um, so yeah, those are the two items I recommend going for. Um, you wanna, or you just never wanna go for the, the, the most sought after items, it's as simple as that, but you want you to go for smaller gains um, where you have a much likeliness of, or likelihood of copying um, or purchasing the item so you can then flip it for small gain. That's fine with small gain. Those small gains add up. It's just the formula of it. Um, just hopefully you keep your emotions out of it when those final minutes, final seconds come about and just act, you get it down. Practice is progression. So um, general thoughts on the other items. I don't know why the hell there's a glass spray bottle. A glass spray bottle, come on now. Um, the decks are dope. If money wasn't an object, I'd probably just get the set, both of them if I could. Fuck okay. it. Um, that gray hoodie, obviously if money wasn't an object, shit. I would just try to go for that, take an L, because everyone's gonna get an L going for that one. Uh, and then just pay the resale, because that is a fire hoodie. Um, and then, I mean, if I were to choose a denim jacket here, the blue, um, denim would be it but i don't give a shit for burberry so fuck that i'd probably end up with that beige brown one or the plaid the bucket hats hey me i feel like they're rain hats in my book so i'm passing on that even if i was like loaded i'd pass my shit um if anything i fuck with this black one but i'm not a puffer guy so fuck that entirely um pass on all that shit uh, pass on the caps, I ain't trying to flex, that black, and maybe even this pink rugby shirt, I'd fuck with that. So, um, or the light blue, but nah, that light blue is a little too elegant for my liking, I'll be honest. So, but the rest, uh, I mean the trench coat, I'd fuck with it, I'd fuck with this, this beige one. That one looks slick. Look at that collar, look at that. You can tell that's high quality leather. I do admire high quality materials, but for the price that you have to pay with the Burberry like logo and the brand, it's just, I ain't, I ain't attached like that. I ain't getting attached to anything like that. Um, 
thousand bucks? Is that right? Wow. That's a no-brainer no to me. Um, but let's see what else we got. We got silky pajama sets here. I guess that's exclusive to Burberry, but nah, I don't need that. If anything, the beanie, I mean this this navy blue beanie is kind of fire. If I were to pick one, I'd get that navy blue. I don't even know if it's navy, it's just blue. It's, it's not dark like a, like a navy. Or at least it doesn't look like it. But I'd either mess with that. Nah, it would just be the blue. Fuck it. If I was loaded, yeah, throw that in there. Um, and then let's get to the bottom here, wrap this up. I don't really give a shit about a lot of the other things, but like fuck these caps, fuck these caps, fuck these jackets, those are horrendous. Um, and also another horrendous item on this list is this pink. Ugh. It's like that, it's almost like hot pink it looks like. It's just so ugly, that trench coat. But all right, let's get back to the bottom of the list here. These, these uh, sweatshirts with the angel hoodie, like there's this little baby angel or something. Um, I think they're pretty dope, but I hate how it, there's like you're stuck with this green font color of the Supreme bubbly kind of lettering here. That's the only thing that kind of irritates me because it's kind of ugly, kind of like, you know, it's kind of slimy, grimy green. So, um, but I like the personality of some, of like sweatshirts like this with Supreme. I mean, it's a little baby angel. We don't really know what he's doing on there, but I like it. But that's if money was no object, I ain't gonna spend like 160, 170 bucks or something like that, so. Um, so yeah, that's just my general thoughts um, on the items. I re recommend going for that pink hoodie right off the bat in sizes either medium or large or try to cop the medium large rugby black jack or not jacket, uh, just that shirt. So with that, I'll wrap it up um, with saying best of luck for or best of luck to everybody who's trying to cop. Hopefully um, this tier is pretty fire there's a lot of really nice things on here they just don't really pertain to me um and i already got you know i don't need every box logo i mean i just need a couple pieces um but best of luck to everyone um with that uh keep your head up practice is progression and that's what it's all about um i hope everyone has a great day or uh, yeah, a blessed uh, future